Hey there, Nilofar Sabdar here and uh, today is another video in this series of um, what keeps you from massive success and one of the things that somebody posted on this was uh, inability to change the here and now and inability to accept the here and now. So here's the thing, you know, we, uh, we are unable to look at things the way they are okay so we actually almost like wear these uh, these colored uh, colored glasses and we're looking at the world through those colored glasses we are not able to see the world as it is and even if we can see the world as it is we uh, we judge it and we go it should be like this, it shouldn't be like this, and all of that. So what if, you know, we could look at everything that is going on as just an interesting point of view? So when you, uh, when you don't align and agree with something or when you don't resist and react to something, then you can be in allowance of whatever is going on. And when you actually can be in allowance for whatever is going on, you can actually then change that thing, okay? Now, it's really easy uh, for us to say it, but how do you actually apply it in your life? So, um, I'd like to, uh, you know, uh, take you through an energy psychology protocol. And uh, one of the energy psychology techniques is EFT or emotional freedom techniques. And uh, in emotional freedom techniques, we actually say a few statements and then we tap on the end point of meridians. So it's like whatever is stored in our bodies and in our mind, when we go through this protocol, we are letting go of all that, okay? So we are letting go of all the charge that we have or all the polarization that we have about whatever is going on, okay? So let's do a round of tapping on this, okay? So even though I am unable to uh, be in allowance of the here and now, I love and approve of myself the way I am. Even though I am not able to be in allowance of the here and now, I love and approve of myself the way I am. Even though I am not in allowance of the here and now, I love and approve of myself the way I am. I am not in allowance of the here and now. I am resisting and reacting of the here and now. I'm, re I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. I'm resisting and reacting to the here and now. So even though I am not in allowance of the here and now, I love and approve of myself the way I am. Even though I'm not in allowance of the here and now, I love and approve of myself the way I am. Even though uh, I am not in allowance of the here and now, I love and approve of myself the way I am. I'm, an, I'm aligning and agreeing to the here and now. I'm aligning and agreeing to the here and now. 
I'm aligning and agreeing to the here and now. I'm aligning and agreeing to the here and now. I'm aligning and agreeing to the here and now. I'm aligning and agreeing to the here and now. I'm aligning and agreeing to the here and now. So uh, let me give you an example, you know. So for example, if you have something really bad going on in your life, so maybe, uh, you know, um, maybe you are out of a job and you are in a really desperate financial situation. And when you say, oh, when you agree and align to that financial situation, oh my God, I've lost my job. And because I've lost my job, I am in such a bad financial situation. That is aligning and agreeing uh, to, uh, to whatever is going on, you know. But if you neither have a reaction, in, neither are you aligning and agreeing to it, nor are you fighting that, oh my God, you know, I have lost my job. How dare that happen? And I have to do something to find it. And, you know, you're like literally fighting that situation. That's also resistance and reaction. In both these cases, you're not in align, uh, you're not in allowance of the situation. Allowance would be, okay, I've uh, I've lost my job, um, and what else is possible here? So that means you're not, um, you're not, uh, you know, you don't have an emotional charge about that, right? So when we do this round of tapping, we are actually releasing the emotional charge around uh, the situation, okay? Now, when you talk about the here and now, whatever the here and now is, it is there because of, uh, of a few incidents which have added up to it, okay? So don't really know what's going on for you. But for example, one of my friends, you know, her husband lost his job four years back and they are going through an incredibly difficult time. So, so it's like uh, they find it a struggle to pay the bills. They find it a struggle to pay for their daughter's school fees. Um, they have to live in a shared apartment and all these kind of things. So, you know, each one of these, you can make that in, into an incident and then you can use that, like take one incident. So, for example, uh, you know, he lost his job. So, you can use that incident and then do a round of tapping on it, okay? So, he lost his job and so take that particular incident and then you can look on a scale of zero to 10, where zero means you have no emotional charge to it. And 10 means that there's an intense emotional charge to it, okay? So whatever number it is, get that number and then do a round of tapping on it, okay? So even though um, this occurred, I love and approve of myself. So this means that particular incident that you're working on. So even though I have this emotional charge about this incident, I love and approve of myself. Even though I'm really upset about this incident, I love and approve of myself the way I am. I'm really upset about this incident. I have an emotional charge about this incident. I'm really, really upset about this incident. I have an emotional charge about this incident. I'm really upset about this incident. I have an emotional charge about this incident. I'm really upset about this incident. I have an emotional charge 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 about this incident. I'm really upset about this incident. I have an emotional charge about this incident. And take a nice deep breath and now check on a scale of zero to 10, what number are you at now? Has it become less, has it become more? If it has changed, it's great because whatever we are doing is working. Some, sometimes what is underneath that comes up and so your emotional intensity might go up, right? So it's great and so you continue to, to tap on it. So, so like that, take one, one incident, 
which is connected to that uh, thing, whatever is going on in your life, like the here and now she's talking about and start tapping on it and keep tapping until you know your charge becomes zero on each one of these incidents. Okay, so when your charge becomes zero on each one of these incidents, then you will have no charge around whatever is going on in your life right now. Okay, so now I'll address the second part of this, uh, uh, which is inability to change whatever is going on. Okay, so even though I'm unable to change whatever is going on here and now, I love and accept myself the way I am. Even though I'm unable to change whatever is going on here and now, I love and accept myself the way I am. Even though I'm unable to change whatever is going on, I love and accept myself the way I am. Even though I'm unable to change whatever is going on, I love and accept myself the way I am. I'm unable to change whatever is going on. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life. Even though I'm unable to change whatever is going on in my life, what if I could? What would it be like if I were able to change whatever is going on in my life? So what would it be like if I could change whatever is going on in my life? What would it be like if I were able to change the here and now? What would it be like if my here and now could change? What if my here and now could change? I wonder what if my here and now could change. I wonder what else is possible with my here and now. I wonder what would it be like if my here and now could change. I wonder what would it be like if my here and now could change. I wonder what would it be like if my here and now could change. I wonder what would it be like if my here and now could change. I wonder what would it be like if my here and now could change. I wonder what would it be like if my here and now could change. I wonder what would it be like if my here and now could change. I wonder what would it be like if my here and now could change. So so notice what I did was I took actually what was going on, which is like I'm unable to change my here and now, and I did a little bit of tapping and then in the other rounds I flipped it over and I started asking what would it be like and so as you start doing that you 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 know I almost started getting happy okay so you start with whatever acknowledging whatever is going on and then you go to what you desire there okay so um, uh, so just you know rewind this video and keep tapping along over and over and over again and you will start to change bits and pieces aspects of that here and now that you're talking about and uh, then pretty much very soon you will suddenly find that a lot of charge around that has gone away and also that whole situation has started to change so thank you again for listening to me and I look forward to talking to you again in another Facebook Live video. Bye, everyone.